I still can't believe this is where we stayed for two days. Unbelievable. We were waiting for this day for a little while now. It's probably the reason we were most excited to come to Dubai in the first place. We're gonna check out of this hotel now and head out to the Dubai desert. But before we get there, just wanna say, all of what you're about to see was booked entirely on credit card points. So if you wanna learn how to do it too, stick around to the end of the video. Welcome to the desert. An hour long ride out of Dubai and yes, now we're actually in the desert. I can't believe it. We're here. What are you? Hello. More. There's more. Hi, did you get lost? Is everything okay? Okay. Bye bye. All right, see you in two days, you guys. Take care. Because of the animals? Yeah. yeah, so in Arabic, uh, this one is Oryx, Arabian Oryx, but in Arabic it's called Alma. Thank you. Oh, yes. All right, let's go for a ride. Are we here? Yeah. Yes, we are in your suit now. Okay, so we're entering to our villa. Whoa. <laughs> Steve, look at this. Look at the bathroom! Yeah. Oh my god! What is happening here? Ariel, is this real? It's your room. You kidding me. I've never seen anything like this in my <laughs> life before. I'm not even kidding. It's warm already, 29 degrees. Oh. Oh, it's really warm, so we can swim at night? You can, yeah. You have no reaction to this scene, <laughs> like seriously? I, <laughs> like you have no reaction? I knew what I was getting myself into when I booked it. This is what points can do. This is insane. They have complimentary dates, nuts, and is that baklava? Mm. Hey, complimentary, I'll take it. Here it is. Cheers, Gokche. So we just got to Almaha and we were starving and we decided to order lunch into the room. They set it out on the porch for us, in-room dining, all included. It really is a dream here. Go. Oh my God, Steve. They smell the food for sure. I'm having the best time of my life. Well, after the kangaroos this year. Still better than our wedding, huh? <laughs> Probably. This is certainly one of the best parts about this room is how it's just a part of the nature that's surrounding here and you're able to have gazelles, birds, it doesn't matter, just straight walk up to your porch and... Good morning, so out here in the desert, of course, it would be pretty easy to get bored if the resort didn't set up things to do. So we're off now to do some four by four dune bashing and uh, Gokshe, of course, is uh, with her friends, the gazelles. Good morning. <laughs> Gazelle. Hi, lovely. Hi, can I just touch you off? I don't know what I'm getting myself into. This is so cool, the Jeeps look like they're the Jeeps from Jurassic Park a little bit. Oh my God, yes. No dinosaurs, hopefully. <laughs> Are you driving? Yes, I am. Oh! So I'm gonna be embarrassingly telling the truth. I'm doing something for Steve because he wanted to. <laughs> <laughs> so from my understanding, we're gonna be just doing a speed car on the dunes, right? Pretty much. Awesome. Just in front of the mountains, there's a big dune. You see that? Yeah. yeah that's where we drive to. Awesome. Ah, okay. So it hasn't even started yet. We're just getting there to start. It's, a, it's like a warm up. Did you get trained for this? I definitely did. <laughs> oh, there's a camel. Oh, there's a camel. <laughs> On the right. On the left, too. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, Here we go. <laughs> pushing out of the sand, but it's beautiful. Help me. <laughs> Am 
Milan is actually not too far from here. That's so oh. cool. Look at that, Steve. All right, had our fun at the top of this sand dune. And now let's get back down. Be careful, darling. Let's. I'm gonna turn the camera off so I can get down safely. See you at the bottom. <laughs> I am still feeling a little motion sickness, but I did well, I did well. We're heading over to our latest activity, which <laughs> is camel riding. And this is going to be my first time. Steve has done it before. So I'm probably extra nervous about that. Nope. And there are the camels up ahead. Yeah. Looking so uh, fashionable, Steve. You know how I roll. Hi, lovely. I know you've been looking at me. Maybe I can pick you. How are you doing, Steve? Uh, just like riding a horse, I think. And here's our trainer. Didn't realize how tall the camels are. <laughs> 2.18 meters to be exact. Wow. 2.8? 2.18. 2.18. Oh, okay. 2.8 would be substantially high. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah well, some of them do like. Yeah, this, this one, one. This one loves laying and this one also loves laying. The sun's setting. It looks so beautiful. And honestly, it's been such a nice ride. She's been really good. <laughs> we made it here. Oh. And we heard there's a bar. There's a bar? <laughs> Thank you. Cheers. Now, camel ride back to the yes. hotel. Oh, very nice of you. Right in front of us. Shame. Shame. Yeah. See you on the other side. See you on the other side. Okay? Yeah. I mean, it's always fun to go camel riding, I think. And it's even better to go camel riding at sunset. I don't know which side I'm coming out better on. <laughs> I don't know why he's switching and everything right on left. Uh, this was an incredible experience and so lucky that this happened. We're so happy and so thankful for everything. And uh, dinner's right out that way. Are you going to be able to eat all this? No. Nice platter. <laughs> and this is my lobster. It's been such a unique experience and I'm just absolutely thankful that we got this experience together. All right, so finally, I wanna talk about how you could actually book this as well by using your Marriott points to stay at the Al Maha Desert Resort here in the Dubai Desert Conservatory. We booked this for 70,000 points a night, which is actually Marriott's off-peak pricing for this property. You could accumulate Marriott points no matter where you are in the world, and that's the beautiful thing. There's over 6,000 Marriott properties, and you just sign up for an account, you start accumulating points based upon your stays, and then once you accumulate enough points to stay at a certain hotel, you could book that hotel as long as they have a standard room available. You don't necessarily need to stay here at the Al Maha. You could use it to book Disney World and take your family there. You could use it to book Hawaii. You could use it to book other vacations in Europe. It really can completely depends on you. Now, if you have access to the American credit card system, there's actually a little bit of a shortcut to accumulate a lot of Marriott points a heck of a lot quicker, and that's going to be through travel rewards credit cards. And if you want to find out more about that or how exactly step-by-step -step I book this, you can head over to our Patreon. I'm going to link that down below, and I am going to be able to teach you step-by-step. -step. You're going to see over my shoulder exactly how we book this resort, how you could book Disney, how you could book a trip to Hawaii. I'm going to wrap up now, though. We're gonna enjoy our last few moments here at Al Maha and this Dubai desert experience has been absolutely jaw dropping and I hope that through saving up your Marriott points, you could experience it too. It's so worth it. How are you doing? <laughs>